that zip. Can you guess what was there right before I hit record? Here's the beep and she starts running. Hey, pumpkin. How you doing, bite? You got some place to go? Sit at my desk and she's been over here at my feet for the last, like, 15 minutes harassing me and I've been petting her and then I pick this up and she hears the beep and she goes nah no thanks not today hey what's up garden friends Jeff here how's everybody doing hope you're doing well I'm great welcome to today's episode of I forgot what day it was and there's a video that needs to come out tomorrow happy holidays right it's just the nature of things everyone's busy right now I don't have much planned for the rest of the year taking it easy have family coming in town been working on this room renovation here hence the mess and the ladder, paint and things going on, baseboards and crowns gonna be happening here hopefully sooner than later. As soon as I can just, I have to, once I learn how to do it, then that's, that's my goal. I don't know, after the holidays, maybe a new ceiling fan, cause this one's pretty ridiculous, but it's so ridiculous that it's really starting to grow on me because it's just why what, I mean, I guess it makes sense if you want to do like a cute room for a little girl or a little boy who likes carousel horses, whatever, you know, you do your thing, but that just doesn't really fit the vibe, but I don't know what the vibe is because I don't really have a vibe. I like something and I do it. Don't really care about the design rules or principles. That's never been my thing. Makes my eyes happy. That's all that matters. Missed call. Always getting missed calls from my insurance company. They're constantly calling to like, let me know about my new benefits. I don't understand. I'm well aware. $400 a month. You think that I haven't thoroughly researched what my options and benefits are? I picked these up on clearance. I, I don't know how I feel about them. This has nothing to do with anything that I had planned for the video or what I didn't have planned for the video. Just figured I'd bring it along for something little and stupid. Two minutes into the video, hopefully you enjoyed that. Part of the problem is that it's getting dark outside. So that means I can't do much, oh yeah, can't really see anything through the tent, can you? Other than my hoodie, you see that? Isn't that beautiful? So I was thinking, these things make me so nervous. These are new, they don't have the string, you just push them. I don't like it. feels like every time I'm adjusting them, I'm just going to rip them off the wall, which I could. That wouldn't shock me. And sorry, pumpkin, no plastic bags. Get away from there. That's not safe. I break the handles on them so I don't have to worry about them getting strangled, but still, she likes to chew on plastic. That um, ornament. I thought it'd be fun to set that inside of like a big pot and throw some spruce branches underneath it and maybe some ornaments. Might be fun. Just something that will look a little bit nice outside. Don't mind the arrangement. I'm trying to decide what kind of metal I like. I don't, turns out I, I don't really care for any of them. Here's the piece, Lily. I told y'all I was gonna get up on the shelf. There, there it is, on the shelf. So it is dark, but I'm gonna do stuff with some Christmas lights. So does it, did it matter? I don't think it actually matters that it's dark. Let's go do that. You coming, pumpkin? Are you gonna stay in here? I'd rather you didn't. You wanna come with me? You coming? Come on, come on, we got things to do. I'd rather you not stay in here by yourself. There's too many things. Let's go, come on. No? Fine. We'll get it. Isn't it just beautiful? I love the way it lights up the bamboo and everything. It just looks nice. It's sparkly and shiny and gives off that beautiful glow. It's tranquil and relaxing the way all the little leaves. Like, you get it. It's, it's bright. I like it. It's nice and bright. Bright and shiny. What's not to love? That's a snowman riding a polar bear. Different aesthetic, but still fun. So what I was thinking, oh, maybe I shouldn't be doing this at night. It's pretty dark over here. Is that better? That's a little bit better. Turn the light on. That helps. So what I was thinking for this, Remember, this is not meant to be taken too seriously. We're just doing something fun and stupid. I have this great big pot here that I've been slowly filling with plastic and yard waste, just trying to get it filled up. Might look nice to set this in there in between those two pots that are back there and then fill in the surroundings with some spruce cuttings. Maybe throw some plastic ornaments in there. I don't think I have quite enough stuff in there though. Extra bag of mulch. That worked out well. I think that'll probably better because it's more level. In theory, you can just pick this up and set it in here like so. Maybe, hopefully. Where's the base? <laughs> yep. Thought I hadn't moved the camera. This pot down here, it keeps blowing over. I think I'm just gonna pick it up and take it inside. It'll look better, elevated and up there, like actually hanging out inside of the bamboo. And I know that doesn't look great. It's an easy fix. I'm gonna cut some branches off the spruce tree, stuff those down there. Like I said, maybe I'll throw some ornaments in there. I don't really need to go over the top with this because it's supposed to be absolutely frigid the next several days. On Thursday, they're predicting a blizzard. It's not a blizzard, but they're treating it like a blizzard. A few inches of snow, but lows below zero. So it's not, no one's going to be out here looking at this thing. I was about to say, I don't know how visible any of this is going to be, but I have the good lens on the camera right now, so 
Hopefully you can, I mean, that was it. You just got the idea. I'm gonna cut some spruce branches off and put them in a pot, which needed to be done anyways. Look at this, doesn't that look bad? And get these lower pieces out and be able to get in there and clean all that up. Might have to plant some shrubs here next year. That's really gonna open things up. And y'all know I do not like to be able to see through my fence. Been so long since I had filmed outside because we had crazy, stupid cold fall. I forgot what a delight it is to film out here with the tripod when Turbo's with me. Yes, that was completely and totally sarcasm. I like this, pointless. This video didn't need to be made, but just checking in, saying hi. Some of y'all look forward to the Wednesday videos and that's, here we are. Hi. I said I was gonna put the plastic ornaments down there or on the base, but I don't think that's a great idea because of Turbo. I'm pretty sure he's just gonna pull them up and run away with them. That seems right up Turbo's alley. Plastic ornaments right where he can grab onto them. That's, no, ask him for trouble. Yeah, does that look nice though? It's beautiful. I'll have some cleaning up to do outside. Like I said, I'm just gonna move that pot inside since it won't stay standing upright. Things are about to get really busy out here. I do love the winter sky. It's so clear and pretty. Plants have to come inside. Not to, well, tomorrow for y'all. The mule palms, windmill palms. I might even be moving some of the shrubbery inside that was just meant to be nice evergreen shrubbery to have outside in the containers. With it predicted to be minus four, I'm thinking those should definitely probably go in or I may, this is probably all gonna be in a vlog. So I don't know if we even be talking about this right now, but hey, here's a preview. I have a few bags of mulch left over here and a few extra over there. So I was thinking I might lay some shrubbery flat down in here and I will probably be using a frost blanket across this whole area with some light bulbs. Uh, just some C9 Christmas, but it doesn't matter. I know what I'm doing. I've had to protect plants plenty of times. We'll see what I decide to do. That's what's going on here. Hope everybody's doing well. Having a great day and a great life. Everything's just going beautifully for you. Comment down below. Say hi. I love talking to everybody. I'm sure everybody's very busy and I'll be seeing you Saturday. Probably going to be a quick video though. That's more than likely going to be the nature of videos for the rest of the year. The next few videos probably going to be pretty laid back and last minute. Look at that. Isn't that just so stinking beautiful? I got this from Sam's Club back in like late September. You know how that goes. The stuff sells out so fast when you see it, you have to get it. Even though I don't like to buy stuff when it's technically still summer. Glad that I got it. Looks nice, sparkly, fancy. It's nice, big, shiny balls. I don't know what it was called. That maybe three ornament lighted ornament tower. I don't know. I would imagine it's sold out by now. I do think back to the protecting the plants, the bamboo. Minus four degrees Fahrenheit. Even at nighttime with the airplanes, they never stop. These are probably, I'm gonna, have to, I'm gonna have to do something with those too. Probably lights and frost cloth, all that fun stuff. Gonna have to get the containers moved and yeah, plenty to do. Turbo, where'd your collar go? Turbo, where's your collar? Why are you naked? What happened? No, seriously, what did you do? Why, why when it's dark? How did your collar come off? What the crap? It's fine. There are spare collars in the house and spare tags because he somehow tends to rip them off. As always, and most importantly, everybody, keep on growing. Bye bye. How do you even do that, Turbo? No shortage of collars around here. Oh, this is gonna be entertaining. <laughs> you gotta look at the camera, huh? There you go, looking handsome. These are cute, but yeah, I think we're gonna have to cut those off. That's gotta be annoying, right, Turbo? Yeah, good boy.